Meet a mysterious figure who doesn't need capes or masks to be a hero. The Equalizer, a 1985 TV series, follows the enigmatic Robert McCall, a retired intelligence agent turned vigilante, as he steps into the shadows to right the wrongs of an unjust world. This action-packed series delivers a roller coaster of emotions with its mix of funny, shocking, and sad moments. Wondering if there's a particular scene that has left a lasting impact on you. Keep watching, there's more to come. What makes this enduring through the years? Perhaps it's the timeless qualities embedded in the narrative, creating an everlasting symbol of the industry. The blend of suspense, justice, and McCall's unwavering sense of morality strikes a chord that resonates with audiences across generations. Now, share your most cherished memory or personal experience tied to The Equalizer in the comments below. Your voice matters. Stay tuned for more tales from this captivating series. There are countless stories waiting to unfold, and we're here for every thrilling moment. Keep your eyes on the screen and your memories close. The television series from 1985, The Equalizer, captivated viewers with its compelling narrative and standout performances. Edward McCall, portrayed by Edward Woodward, embodied a seasoned professional seeking redemption through altruistic endeavors. The show distinguished itself by weaving intriguing storylines akin to other prominent 80s shows, yet it stood out with McCall's unique approach to problem solving. As a former company man grappling with a guilty conscience, McCall utilized his Cold War home skills to aid the defenseless. The series skillfully navigated diverse cases, maintaining a balance between suspense and resolution. McCall's method of intelligence, reminiscent of an astute intelligence officer, involved meticulous plotting, probing, planning, and visualization. The narrative unfolded through his ability to outwit adversaries, resulting in an engaging and intellectually stimulating television experience. The ensemble cast contributed to the show's success, with each character adding depth to McCall's world. Notably, Mickey brought a blend of quirkiness and proficiency to the mix. Despite the show's strengths, some viewers wished for certain adjustments, such as giving a name to the character control and a more expedited resolution to the Jason storyline. Woodward's portrayal of McCall resonated strongly with audiences, and the series offered a refreshing departure from the self-centered themes prevalent in contemporary TV. The show's distinctive approach to justice, combined with its departure from typical narrative tropes, left an enduring impact on viewers. In retrospect, The Equalizer remains a noteworthy representation of 80s television at its peak, offering a departure from the norm and a compelling exploration of justice and redemption through the eyes of a seasoned operative. Its potential influence on subsequent adaptations like a movie rendition adds to its lasting legacy. While the show experienced a decline in ratings during a specific political era, its relevance and resonance endure, with the prospect of a modern-day reboot featuring Denzel Washington as Edward McCall, generating excitement among fans. The original series, with Edward Woodward's standout performance, remains a timeless testament to the era's storytelling prowess. In the Confirmation Day episode of its first season, The Equalizer showcases a memorable scene where McCall, portrayed by Edward Woodward, deftly maneuvers a stolen delivery truck. Notably, Woodward took the wheel for the entire sequence, emphasizing his commitment to authenticity. The scene, where the truck's rear tire brushes against the guardrail, captures his hands-on approach to the role. Interestingly, the pilot introduces a pet Irish setter as McCall's companion, but this character disappears from subsequent episodes without explanation. The Irish setter becomes a fleeting presence, leaving fans curious about its absence in the remainder of the series. Edward Woodward's casting as the Equalizer can be traced back to his role in The Wicker Man. His portrayal in the gritty British TV drama Callan, depicting a secret service assassin, showcased the depth of his acting prowess. This background likely influenced the decision to cast him as the enigmatic McCall, a character that resonated with audiences for his unique brand of justice. In crafting the series, it leveraged Woodward's nuanced performance and Cold War honed skills to present a distinctive take on justice. The show's narrative, characterized by astute problem-solving methods, set it apart from other 80s TV series. The ensemble cast, including characters like Mickey, added depth to the world, contributing to the overall success. As the series progressed, certain adjustments were suggested by viewers, such as giving a name to the character control and expediting the resolution to the Jason storyline. Despite these considerations, Woodward's portrayal remained a strong anchor, offering a departure from prevailing self-centered themes in contemporary TV. 
Its enduring impact lies in its departure from typical narrative tropes and its exploration of justice and redemption through the eyes of a seasoned operative. While the series faced a decline in ratings during a specific political era, its relevance persists, with excitement building around the prospect of a modern-day reboot featuring Denzel Washington as the lead. In retrospect, it stands as a noteworthy representation of 80s television at its peak, leaving an indelible mark on viewers. Its potential influence on subsequent adaptations underscores its lasting legacy in the realm of television storytelling. The lead character, Robert McCall, was specifically written with Edward Woodward in mind. McCall, portrayed by Woodward, navigated the streets of New York in a black Jaguar with the license plate number 58809 AUJ. Interestingly, during the show's peak popularity, Woodward found himself approached by real people facing situations mirroring those depicted in the series. In response, he carried flyers with phone numbers for social services and legal clinics ready to aid those in need. McCall's commitment to authenticity extended to driving the Jaguar himself in scenes such as the memorable sequence in the Confirmation Day episode. The pilot introduced a pet Irish setter as McCall's companion, though this character inexplicably vanished from subsequent episodes, leaving fans curious about its absence. Edward Woodward's casting as McCall drew from his previous roles, particularly in The Wicker Man and the British TV drama Callan, where he portrayed a Secret Service assassin. This background influenced the decision to cast him as the enigmatic McCall, a character resonating with audiences for his unique brand of justice. The Equalizer, with Woodward at the helm, offered a distinctive take on justice through astute problem-solving methods. Despite viewer suggestions for adjustments, such as giving a name to the character control and resolving the Jason storyline more swiftly, Woodward's portrayal remained a strong anchor. The show's enduring impact lies in its departure from typical narrative tropes, exploring justice and redemption through the eyes of a seasoned operative. As the series faced a decline in ratings during a specific political era, its relevance persists, generating excitement around the prospect of a modern-day reboot featuring Denzel Washington. In retrospect, The Equalizer stands as a noteworthy representation of 80s television, leaving an impression on viewers and potentially influencing subsequent adaptations. Edward Woodward, in a revealing interview, shared an interesting encounter with Arnold Schwarzenegger, who expressed admiration for his work on The Equalizer. Schwarzenegger, known for action movies, received a stern look from Woodward, showcasing a unique exchange between two figures from distinct genres. Woodward's portrayal of Robert McCall earned him five consecutive Emmy nominations for Outstanding Lead Actor in a Drama Series. Despite the show running for four seasons, its late 1989 conclusion allowed him to be nominated in 1990 for the 1989-1990 season. This consistent recognition underscores his compelling performance as the enigmatic vigilante. A distinctive element of the show is McCall's phone number 212 555 4200, adding a touch of realism to the character's world. This simple yet memorable detail resonated with viewers, further enhancing its authenticity. In summary, The Equalizer not only garnered critical acclaim for Woodward's portrayal, but also witnessed interesting interactions with Hollywood icons. The longevity of his Emmy nominations and the inclusion of a genuine phone number in the storyline contributed to the show's unique appeal.